And the House of Representatives has launched a probe into the remote and immediate causes of rising prices of food items, goods and services in Nigeria over the last one year. It's also to dig into alleged extortion and sundry charges on agro-export businesses in the country. National Assembly correspondent Jokia reports. In the last one year, the prices of food items, commodities, goods and services have hit the roof in Nigeria. The over 100% rise is attributed to government's monetary policy, border closures, insecurity, COVID-19 containment measures, and inflation. Under the Constitution, in order to ensure it. In his motion of urgent national importance, Isiaka Ibrahim from Ubu State says life has become increasingly difficult for many Nigerians and seeks parliament's intervention. Price index in the past months has increased astronomically owing to many controllable and uncontrollable factors, with the inflation rising at about 48 months high, posing the challenge of increased spending on housing, shelter, medicals. The lawmakers also resolved to probe issues adversely affecting air cargo freighting and agro-export businesses in the country. The House is worried by the recent reports that 11 out of the 16 sundry charges lined up against a cargo are illegal and are official bottlenecks. Increasing moral decadence in the country prompted Imo legislator Uju Chima to converse the reintroduction of moral instructions as a compulsory subject in the school curricula. Due to the removal of moral instructions from school system, the current generation of youth lies the basis, the benefits of such lessons and may end up as nuisance in the society. Members also supported a proposed law seeking to prevent the transmission of hospital-acquired infections sponsored by Bimbola Ajile Shuru from Moshu State. I stand to move the bills of an act to establish the contamination centers within each of the 30, 36 states and the federal capital territory of Nigeria with the responsibility of cleaning, disinfecting, and sterilization of medical devices and instruments prior to reuse. The lawmakers also look forward to seeing relevant authorities put an end to illegal mining in parts of Oshun State. Jokia Adsa, TVC News, Abuja.